it's Jamie and I'm Zia. And this is Zia. So today is day 26 of our design a day challenge, 30 day challenge. And Zia was showing me some really cool science stuff. And we thought, you know what, this would make a very cool dress template design, we think. So we're gonna, in the name of science, we're gonna do a little bit of experimenting. And we did a little preparation work to get this one ready before Zia takes over. What I did is I hollowed out a dress template as we've done a few times before with a few other designs and I taped it to a tray similar to what we did on soup day. So I, I taped it to a tray so that we have a little bin, a little space. So I'm gonna have you explain it step by step, okay? okay. All right, so first, what are the supplies that we have? We have milk, we have a template, okay, and we have some dish soap. Okay, and we poured our dish soap in a tiny little tray, a uh, little Petri dish. Yep. And then what do we have here? We have some food coloring. What we colors have, are we using? We're using purple, aqua, and pink, and you could use any color of your choice. Any color you want. And then we have these little plastic swords, which are really hard to see from this distance, but we have these little plastic swords we keep handy. We love little things like this for uh, hors d'oeuvres and appetizers around the house. <laughs> Um, but we're using these little plastic swords because Zia says that we need them to do swirling. So, awesome. All right, and then we have a cotton ball. And all right, I'm gonna let you go ahead and demonstrate it. Okay, so what you first wanna do is get, oh. <laughs> get your food coloring and you want to put it in places like anywhere you want. Um, so I'm gonna put some pink right here, here. Here, 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 and here. Awesome. I can't wait to see how this turns out. <laughs> I'm very curious. And then I'm going to put some purple right here, 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 and here. And what does the dish soap do? Like it pushes all the fat to the sides in the milk, and then it um, also pushes that also, and then you need the stick to swirl it in and make beautiful colors. That is super cool. Who knew? Who knew? I say. And then I'm gonna put some blue right here. Here. This is the aqua color. Yes. Oh, very cool. Here and here. Awesome! I cannot wait to see what happens here. And so I'm going to put this cotton ball into the dish soap. Okay. Let it soak its own bit. And then I'm going to get it and... <gasps> whoa, whoa. That's so cool. So it did, it just like pushed everything out. Oh yes. my gosh, that is super... And I'm going to put that to the side. Okay. And then I'm going to... Oh my gosh, okay. And just take your hand away for a second. And let it swirl. That is so magical. It looks like something from Alice in Wonderland. <gasps> Let me take photos. Okay. So that's how you do milk swirls. Join us and subscribe if you're not subscribed already. Thank you for watching.